Ebola virus. What difference? Jim Crow Day. Most radical. It's time to try something new. Hey, everybody. Welcome to News Busted. I'm Jody Miller. Let's get started. A new poll shows 54% of Americans think Hillary Clinton is not honest or trustworthy. And that explains Hillary Clinton's new Secret Service code name, Bill Clinton. <laughs> Speaking of Hillary, her campaign has set a fundraising goal of $2.5 billion. Hillary claims she needs to raise that much in order to get money out of politics. <laughs> now that Bruce Jenner has come out as transgender, late night TV writers were delighted to learn that Jenner is also a Christian and a Republican. This means they can now continue to ridicule him. <laughs> President Obama has taken responsibility for two hostages killed in a U.S. airstrike against al-Qaeda. The president promised an investigation, and he said he will not rest until his next round of golf. <laughs> Security guards confiscated hundreds of fake IDs at California's Coachella Music Festival. The phony IDs were turned over to the Obama administration, who immediately redistributed them to illegal immigrants. <laughs> Hillary Clinton recently said that all her grandparents were immigrants, but records only show that one came to America as a child. Sadly, none of Hillary's grandparents lived to see what a magnificent liar she has become. <laughs> the Philadelphia Eagles have signed quarterback Tim Tebow, and not a moment too soon. It was rumored that after three years of inactivity, Tebow was about to renounce Christianity and join ISIS. <laughs> And finally, a new study shows that Al Capone was probably the worst tax evader of all time. Historians claim that if Capone were alive today, he would probably be a host on MSNBC. <laughs> Thanks for watching News Listed, everybody. I'm Jody Miller. Be sure to subscribe to our videos on YouTube. We'll catch you next time.